Forgotten Cans of Salmon offer surprising insight into ocean health. A team of American scientists has uncovered valuable ecological clues hidden in an unlikely place, decades-old cans of salmon. In one striking example, they opened a can that had expired 50 years ago, only to discover something that surprised researchers and delighted ecologists, a window into the ocean's past. Researchers at the University of Washington examined more than 170 cans of salmon, ranging from 1979 to 2021. What they found inside wasn't ET, just preserved fish, but preserved evidence of marine life. In some of the oldest cans, they identified anisakid worms, a type of marine parasite. Far from being a red flag, their presence actually signals something encouraging, a thriving, balanced ecosystem. These parasites are a sign that the fish came from a healthy marine environment, said Chelsea Wood, co-author of the study. The life cycle of anisakids is complex. They begin in krill, move to fish like salmon, and complete their development in marine mammals. Because their survival depends on multiple species, their presence indicates the robustness of the entire food web. Tracking change through time. By comparing the number of parasites found in salmon from different decades, researchers noticed a gradual increase in their abundance. This trend may suggest a recovering ecosystem or growing populations of marine mammals in the North Pacific. However, other factors, such as climate change, may also play a role. The findings highlight how long-forgotten canned goods can serve as unexpected ecological time capsules, offering a rare glimpse into the health and evolution of marine ecosystems over half a century. Balancing Risk and Reward While informative, these parasites aren't entirely harmless. When consumed, undercooked, or raw, anisakids can cause serious illness in humans. Fortunately, canned fish avoids this risk. The heat used in the canning process sterilizes the contents, making them completely safe to eat, even after decades. The study raises an important question. How do we protect the critical role these organisms play in ecosystems while managing the risks they pose to food safety? For now, careful preparation, such as proper cooking or freezing, remains key when consuming raw or minimally processed fish. From pantry to research lab, what began with a dusty can in a forgotten cupboard has turned into an ambitious scientific endeavor. The research team now plans to dive deeper into preserved seafood archives, hoping to uncover more about long-term ecological shifts and the impacts of climate change on marine life. It turns out sometimes the best clues to the future of our oceans come sealed in tin.